Oh, we got Sonic versus Banjo. I actually didn't know. Oh, that was Soli's counter pick. I forgot. Hey, what's up? Uh, so you guys are actually live right now, and you have Soli versus Jackal to commentate. All right, look at these two characters. We got Sonic and Banjo on Wi-Fi. Classic matchup. Oh, Banjo on Wi-Fi is, I think, like such a scary character. He's, I, I want to say it's like a snake light almost, the way you can camp with the eggs. And obviously you got the Wi-Fi buff and it can't be harder to react to a lot of those things. But I've seen a lot of plays that you can do with Banjo. There's a lot of combos you can pull off. And then obviously with the Wi-Fi buff, it makes it hard to get the uh, side B to react to the side B. I just died of that randomly. No question, but no, Wi-Fi is very, very different jungle, very different game. A lot of things that probably shouldn't work, wouldn't work on land, definitely do. In these waters out here, you definitely gotta be extra careful on Wi-Fi. Oh, look at that side beast. Just throwing it out, you know? Yeah, See like, if it lands. That's the, that's the kind of thing you can do on Wi-Fi. It's like, you know what, this may, this may work, it may not. Let's just see what's going on. We're just going we to throw that out there. We're going to see what's going on here. But right now, you can see Jack getting busy with the feats, the educated feet of Sonic. I wonder what community college they went to. Right now, Jack Yeah, same situation. I mean, with Sonic speed and just the ability to get in and get out really quickly. On, on Wi-Fi, it's going to be much harder to punish that. Yeah, it's, it's definitely, this is going to be, Sonic is definitely going to be a menace. Hard to deal with in this environment. And Sully takes the first stock with a back throw. Oh, Jackal returns the favor immediately Spawned after. Him right back to him. Yeah, nice bear. This is just going to be a match of just chip battle. Constantly. Yeah. Hitting, running away, trying to chip in damage until you can get that final hit. Sonic exactly like that. Going back and forth with Yeah, both of them are, both of these guys are finding it hard to get any sort of confirms on each other. It's just chip damage, chip damage. Yeah, the first one who lands the first real major amount of offense is going to be the one who will have the advantage in this game. But right now, they're finding a hard time even finding that. Oh, look at this forward smash. He's like, he's like, uh, he's not going to get that extra guard with the up B. Oh, look at that. Look at that side B. From Sully. Just throwing it out there. It's like, yo, I can do what I want. It's the Wi-Fi chunk. Yeah, he's got three more anyway. You might as well use them. The good old Wonder Wing to his advantage. Jackal not really forcing anything. He, he knows he can get this kill whenever he, he needs to. Of course. He's, he's very good at that, I must say. He's very good at knowing what his game is, what his game plan is, going into it, adjusting on the fly. Also, not like that. Sometimes you just need to approach you to the dance. Right, how... We might see a similar situation again. That's not gonna kill. Sonic doesn't have a variety... Oh, there it is. Back air is one of his kill options. But I was, a, I was just about to mention, it doesn't have a variety of kill options to choose from. It does stem from just getting like a forward air or back air off stage normally. And there's no opportunity really to gimp Banjo with the up B. That, that. Yeah, Sully is probably looking for like a grab of some sort to finish off this kill. But the way Sonic works is just never gonna get a grab. He's never gonna be on the ground for too long. Oh, back here off stage, nice. Nice from Sully. 84%. Uh, I mean, that's, that's pretty high, yeah, but Banjo's a pretty heavy character. Oh, yeah, wow. That just barely killed. 
nice read from Jacko. Sully could have probably done a little bit better. Maybe just maybe he wanted to snap right to ledge there, but missed it, and he paid the price. So I think I saw earlier Sully was playing. Who was he playing? Yeah. Also, uh, Mosh Pit, Noel, uh, is your mic fine? Are you talking on your phone right now or your computer? Can you hear him? I could hear I could hear him before, but his like his voice was active but didn't nothing happened right now. Yeah, Noel, your mic right. is like cutting in and out, bro. Uh, we can't we can hear you sometimes and it cuts out like time to time. Is it going? Uh, talk now. Say something. Three, two, no, it's it's cut off. Yeah, brother. I think your mic's uh, a little messed up. Are you on PC right now, or are you on? Oh, well, anyways, we'll talk about that later. Should you can get back into the match? Uh, just a little commentary for now while we handle this. I'll uh, message you separately. Uh, okay. Noel. All right, no problem. All right, back to the same matchup on the same stage. PS2. I'm a little curious as to why, you know, he's sticking with the Banjo. It seemed like he did pretty well with Pokemon Trainer in his last matchup against Bankai. He must be thinking he wants these eggs just to kind of get in the way of Jackal's movement for these spin dashes. Both at a high percent right now. Oh, Wonderwing hits him as he's recovering. I'm uh, re super resetting neutral right now. Both of these guys know that this next hit is going to take the stock. Nice down smash from Jackal there. Oh! And then Sully returns the favor. We saw that from uh, game one. Both slots taken back to back. And we're back at it again. I'd like to think this is how most Sonic Banjo matchups go. They're just trading hits one on one. Oh, good two frame there from Jackal. Can't really capitalize on that. Oh, but now he's fighting off stage. Ah, uh, that spin dash isn't gonna connect. Oh, misses that forward smash. Definitely gonna kill it. Stully's doing a really good job of getting out of these spin dash into forward air conversion. That would have definitely killed. Now Jackal has a commanding lead right now. That's going to kill forward air off stage at 140. And now we can really see the kind of menace Sonic is with an advantage. Forcing Banjo to have to approach into this fastball of death. Oh, wow. He gets that up the edge guard right there after the spin spin dash to get Banjo and Sully and take the set 2-0. All right, so quick update, Jitty. Uh, Noel's mic isn't working right now, uh, so we're going to be switching him out for Hangman right now. Okay. And he's oh. actually right here. What's up, Hangman? Ooh. Hello. <laughs> uh, he just he just bounced. Okay. 